You want Lundgren of Lundgren pickups. And it's got a beautiful base here, which is, uh, you've never seen anything like it. So, tell us about it, Yuan. Yes, it's, it's a pickup testing base. So, we can take the, any of our base pickup and put it in any position because it's, uh, we can put it uh, one millimeter closer to the bridge or closer to the neck. So, if, um, if you remember the old uh, jazz base, um, had the bridge pick up a bit closer to the bridge at the 70s yeah. and that affects the tone quite a lot so with this uh, option in our test base I think it's uh, very useful both for us and the customer. I can show you here. Yeah sure. This is really cool. Look at that. This pickup is uh, our dual coil which we make together with Steenbach bases. Okay. So this is a unique double coil which could be used in series, single or parallel. Oh, yeah. okay. So you got at least three different sounds. Yeah. And with this, I told you, we can put it anywhere in this slot. Just a millimeter up or down. So you can use it as a bridge pickup or a neck pickup. And here is the volume controls, tone controls. And um, how, how are they attached uh, if, you, if you pull the pickup out? How are you? They are attached to, uh, with two, uh, two uh, uh, copper. Yeah, copper, yeah. That's uh, really cool. Uh, missing. Uh, it's yeah, made brass. Brass. Br brass, thank you. <laughs> yeah, I thought it was uh, wrong. Yeah. I, I couldn't find the word. No. So you got both uh, ground and the hot. And you can actually choose. If it's go to the bridge controls here or the neck controls there, so you can use it as a bridge or neck pickup. That's in, really cool in the circuit, and you can also use two bypass for every controls as well. So it's it's um, it feels like very complete, and we've got the jazz bass pickups as well, as I told you. Yeah, exactly, jazz vintage bridge. And then you can sh choose if you want to use it very close to the bridge or a bit closer to the middle here. And, uh, and put, yeah. It, and of course, you can use the pickups. Uh, you can use just the sound from the bridge pickup or the neck pickup or both. So it's very versatile, this bass. I can imagine. We, we're proud of it. Yeah, I, yeah, yeah. I, I would be proud of it too. Is it, have you patented the design? No, actually not. Uh, we, we had this uh, test base for uh, uh, three years or something and it's the quite the same concept of our test guitar. Yeah. Uh, this is uh, 16 years old or something. Yeah. And uh, actually I wish I had it 16 years earlier yeah. because it's made the pickup changing a lot easier for us. Yeah. It's and uh, you can hear the sound uh, very, very fast and uh, you can compare two pickups against each other, yeah. other in different positions so it's lovely and it's the same uh, pickups and uh, guitars and amps on our site as yeah. well so that's, that's awesome cool. uh, what other bass pickups are you having here because that's always interesting to, yeah. to look at too. Uh, so now we've seen the vintage uh, ones there and uh, yes, the bass. and then we got the Steenbach yeah the Steenbach one and we got some different P bass yeah. pickups here we got the vintage model here we got the Hawks model and here we also have a soap bar. Yeah. It's a dual coil. Yeah. And this you also can use serial, single, and parallel. That's awesome. So that's three sounds. So it's a pretty modern one, that one, right? In, in, yeah. in, in tone, terms of tone. It's a pretty modern sounding. Yeah, yeah. it's a pretty modern sounding. And uh, it actually fits uh, uh, many kind of music. Yeah. I mean,. Uh, uh, what you say, radio music yeah. and, and metal as well. So it's of course depending on kind yeah. of amp and the kind of fingers and uh, pedals exactly. and everything. So it's a modern sounding, but it's in your fingers. Yeah, exactly. It's all it's all in here. Yeah. Thank you so much for your time, Johan. Thank you. Nice to be here. Nice to meet you.